In today's Voice of Change, think of your favorite brand. What makes it stand out? Originality, sincerity, consistency. Whatever the appeal, there's likely a brand manager behind it. Someone like Larvetta Lofton. She owns a marketing and communication firm, LG Agency. I've worked with several companies from McDonald's to Verizon to General Motors down to ComEd um, and really helping them to build content that is culturally sensitive. And so in a time where I first started, it was all about multicultural marketing. Now it's really about how can we be culturally relevant? So it should come as no surprise that someone known as the Brand Maven is the host of a hugely popular podcast about his Black Businesses Matter, connects and highlights thriving Black entrepreneurs. She often talks about the obstacles minority businesses uh, face. Yes, the podcast touches on the plethora of hurdles that contribute to the racial wealth gap, but it is largely focused on the joy of Black entrepreneurship. She says each episode provides inspiration and actionable tools to help people grow their business. We talk to a lot of people that are looking to start a business. They haven't yet, but they are inspired to know these are things that I should look for. Because here's the thing, what I hope out of the podcast is people can start a business and it doesn't have to take as long to be able to get to their goal. I think if you can hop onto a podcast and learn some of the best practices and some things that probably you shouldn't do, I think that that gives you a leg up to be able to launch your business and launch your business and it be thriving um, in three years. The story of, oh, it's hard the first three years. Yeah, it is. But if you've got the tools to be able to be great, it could be amazing in three years. I saw better if she had any success stories she could share. She told me we'd be here all day if she listed them all. But she did say investors across the nation and the world reach out to her and say, hey, we want to invest in the business you just featured this week. The podcast helped other entrepreneurs team up and collaborate, and new business owners have found mentors as well. Very important. You can find the podcast at blackbusinessesmatter.buzzsprout.com, or you can just look for it on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, wherever you get your podcasts. And you may hear a familiar voice in episode 53. <laughs> um, someone named uh, Anita Blanton. Who is Sounds that? familiar. Who oh. Who said that? Who said what? that? No. What, what are you talking Had about? Had a fantastic time yeah. talking with Larvetta. Uh, thank you for having me on. Um, she has a gift and is a gift mm -hmm. to the city. And so I'm so excited about what she's doing to uplift uh, black businesses, um, especially female-owned, women-owned uh, businesses. So anytime I can... High five, another sister out there, please let me know. I, I had a great time talking yeah, with her. I like what she said. Yeah. Why, why struggle when you start a business when you can learn from other people who have already gone through Absolutely. those struggles? Yeah, yeah, that's great.